This is how to change the head on the Conair Clippers. <coughs> so I bought these a couple of days ago, tried them out for the first time. Well, I've seen this optional smaller head in here for, I guess, your beard and mustache. So I got to pulling on it and pushing on it, and I couldn't get it to come off, and there was no instructions. And I was afraid I was going to break them. So I checked the internet, and it was two videos. One says how to change them, but he never shows you. He just talks about the clippers. The second one, the gentleman had said you got to take these screws out, which takes the metal piece off. Then you got to bend these little pieces back to get it to come out. And then he took the other head and just popped it on. So I was thinking, wait a minute. If this one pops on, so should this one. And I don't think Conair's going to make it where you have to basically take it completely apart to change the heads. So I flipped it over and gave it a little bit more push, and it does pop off. So I popped it off. So... Then I seen they do pop on and off. So here's the small one. You get it on. Get it flat. And you basically you gotta wiggle it and finesse it a little bit. But you can get it to snap on. Now, let's see. It's a little rough. Still not on there all the way. Let's see. Bear with me, guys. This is brand new. It's a little rough. Okay, so now the little one's on. So, turn on. It does work. Turbo. Okay, so, let's click it back off. Now, if there's any young guys out there, please do not do this with it plugged in like I am. I'm just an idiot. Don't be like me. So, let's pop the little one back off. Let's put the main one back on. So, you gotta get it in there. You got to wiggle it just a little bit. And it pops right back on. So, that is how you change the head on the Conair Clippers.